Hey guys, really quickly I'm going to share with you um, just some of my personal techniques on how to pique a person's interest when it comes to your business. Um, using the system is so important in building a business because system of course stands for saving yourself time, energy, and money. But you want to do things that others around you can duplicate. Now, I'm excited about Zija. Um, and I think it's really, really easy. I'll use some creative ways. Hopefully you enjoy these things as well. But you have to re um, begin with the end uh, result in mind. And the overall goal is just to get someone interested in what you have. Now, you got a beverage company. Um, when I first got started, I walked around with the can. When I was in the mall, when I would go in restaurants, when I go in a restaurant now, if I got a bottle of XM3, I'll take it in with me, sit it on the counter, just because I know my waitress or waiter will ask me, what is that? That's all you want to do when piquing somebody's interest. You simply want them to ask, what is it that you have? And my answer is always, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. Um, make it a habit of saying you wouldn't believe me if I told you. A lot of us drop the ball or fumble the ball simply because when somebody asks us what we have, we try to blurt it all out. We try to give them our whole presentation right there on the spot versus using the website, using any um, brochures or newsletters you have on hand, using a pre-recorded call, using a live call. That's what's called using the system, but when you peak interest, you want to make sure you simply move them to the next exposure by giving them something third party they can look at. The most I ever tell people is my personal testimony. Um, I'm passionate about my testimony and what the product has done for me, so I'll share that um, in the peaking of somebody's interest. But all you want is a person to ask, what is it? So I carry the product around with me sometimes. Um, when I'm around people and I hear people talking about things that I've heard the product do for others, I say, hey, I had a friend that experienced that. He doesn't have that problem anymore, though. I hear somebody talking about joint pain. I say, hey, you know what? I Did you say joint pain? Yeah. I had a friend that experienced that. He's not having that problem anymore. And their next question is always, well, what did he do? That's exactly what you want him to say. And your answer is always, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. Some people say, try me. No, I'm not going to tell you because you wouldn't believe me. But I'm going to show you something. We are in the show business. Show somebody the website. Show somebody a brochure. Show somebody some product. Show them a four-day trial. We're in the show business. If you show and tell, you lose. You show and let the product speak for itself. Let the product tell. So when piquing somebody's interest, remember the overall goal is to get them to ask what it is you do. You're using the weight management system. You're losing weight. When people ask you how you did it, tell them. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. So with that, I'm excited, guys. You pique somebody's interest. Get to the next video. Learn what to do and then follow up, um, and we'll go from there. We'll see you over the top. Let's go.